Hello, I'm Gordon Wilkin, Product Application Specialist from Caterpillar Underground Hard Rock Vehicles. Today, we're at the Proving Grounds in Burnie, Tasmania, Australia. It is my pleasure to introduce to you the AD60 C truck. So the AD63 truck is powered by the C27 engine. The C27 is already certified to stage five and it does not require any after treatment or exhaust fluids to do so. The engine remains basically unchanged in the AD63 from the AD60 model. However, a lot of work has been done on the transmission. The gear ratios in the drop box have been changed. The torque converter is different to give us more speed on grade and holding of the higher gears. For the AD63, we've made further improvements to the service compartment. So as you can see behind me, there are all the filters in a centralised location as well as all the service intervals. So all the daily pre-start checks can be done from ground level from this location. The C27 engine is also fitted with the radial air filters. They're mounted at the front of the radiator now. This improvement allows us to get cooler air induction into the C27 engine, helping us to maintain horsepower. Further safety improvements on the AD63 is the access to the top levels. This is now done up the radiator by folding down these steps and folding up all the handrails as you progress along the top of the machine. The AD63 offers a 5% productivity improvement by being rated to 63 metric tonne. To cope with this extra payload, the transmission has had a lot of development. We offer the standard seven speed transmission but it has had changes to the gear ratios, it's had changes to the software. This allows us to maintain speed on grade and to reduce gear hunting. This has greatly improved the productivity of the AD63 truck. Together with that, the automatic retarder system has also been improved to allow us to maintain downhill speed on grade at any selectable speed that the mine site requires. The AD63 now also has a tiltable cab. This greatly improves the access to the C27 engine on the left hand side. Also in this cab area are the brake accumulators and the suspension accumulators. So by being able to tilt the cab, it greatly improves serviceability on your mine site. To assist the AD63 with fuel burn reduction and greenhouse emissions and reduction in carbon footprint, We've designed the AD63 to have a battery powered air conditioning system, commonly called a HVAC system. So the AD63 actually has four batteries, two for the diesel engine and two for the HVAC system. These batteries are mounted here beside the cab. The HVAC system above me is mounted behind the cab. The aim of this is, is that instead of having extended idle periods, you can turn the engine off and the HVAC system will continue to run, ensuring that the operator has full comfort at all times. This will not run down the batteries of your main engine, it can be simply restarted at any time. The AD63 is also equipped with a heavy duty articulation and oscillation hitch. This ensures that all four wheels maintain positive ground pressure, maintaining full traction at all times, regardless of the angles. The AD63 is also fitted with the optional auto lube system. This ensures that all the pins and bushes are lubricated during the operation of the truck. The AD63 also comes equipped with a reversing camera and an optional payload system. The payload systems allows for the continuous monitoring of the payload during tramming or during loading operations. There's an external payload monitoring board which will display the payload to the loader operator. Inside the cab, there's the same display so the truck operator can also maintain weight, ensuring full productivity of every load. An integral part of the tray is the safety pins. This allows for safe maintenance whenever the body is raised. So thank you for your time today. It's been my absolute pleasure to introduce to you the AD63 truck. Please contact your local dealer for more information.